I was watching this clip of Dave getting <laughs> in the head. And then I thought about David's favorite game, Skinny Singles. Pickleball lovers, please subscribe, please leave your comments, and don't forget to have a good day. David forgot okay, to have a good day, but he go. remembered to tell me about Skinny Singles. So basically, you're just playing one side of the court. The server slides over when he hits a serve, and the returner stays on the own box. It's as simple as that. So Micah serves, he slides over, and now we're just playing to the left hand box. Everything goes just like real pickleball, and you're going to learn a lot. There are so many aspects of this game that correlate straight to doubles. Resetting, keeping them deep, firefights, dink in middle. You see that video? It was pretty good. So I won the first point. I'm serving. I'm going to slide over. We play the right hand box. It's zero, zero. When I'm playing, I like to try to earn a lot. And that wasn't very good. The game's 2-11. You get one serve, just like in singles. And you can only score on your point, just like in pickleball. So it's pretty simple. So Mike serves, he slides over to the left hand box. Now I'm trying to keep them deep. And when you're playing this, it's really important to play like real pickleball. Because so many people don't do that in real pickleball. And this is a really good point. And Mike is an awesome student. Thank you so much for letting me put this up. I actually didn't ask him. When you're playing this game, work on keeping the returner deep. Really hit up on the ball, put topspin for two reasons. One, you can control it more. Two, because it might get a funny bounce opposed to hitting it without spin, especially with the more spinny paddles. I believe more spinny is the word. I think it is. I serve, I slide over to the right hand box, and then we play out the point. And you can see how closely this correlates to an actual pickleball match. Look, I'm resetting the ball opposed to just dinking and drilling with two people when your servants are nice and deep put some spin on the ball this will allow you to get an easier third shot drop work on marching towards the kitchen when you're returning hit it nice and deep and get to the kitchen it's a different story so micah serves he slides over i'm trying to keep him deep and I didn't quite, that was not a good shot by me. I let him in, I lost my position. Now it's a dinkin' war. I don't want a dinkin' war. But then I speed it up. And look at those firefights. Look, skinny signals, you get firefights. You get to dink and this simulates wow, real pickleball. Boy. Really does. After drilling a lot, I really like to end a lesson playing skinny singles. I like to do this because at the end of the lesson, they can really put into practice everything they just worked on. So basically the game's to 11, the server always switches sides, and then you play vertically. Now, last lesson, I played like a banger. Mike had a lot of trouble playing with bangers, so I really played like a banger the whole game, hitting it really hard. But you can simulate different players. So if you have a friend that wants to practice playing against someone that hits soft, hit soft that whole game. Now you can only score when you're serving, just like real pickleball, like I said before. And when you're drilling and speed it up, work on hitting your spots. It's not about how hard you hit it. Set up your next shot and gain advantage of the point. Did Micah beat me this game? I'm not going to say yes or no. I will say he's just been getting better and better every time. And he did hit his spot there. He hit my right shoulder. I'm right-handed. I always say right elbow or right shoulder. Aim for your speed ups for a right-handed player. And don't forget, if you do anything in life, don't do this. Don't look like that. <laughs> Boy close, let me recommend this video. This video is really good. I know you want to see me a little more. Pickleball lovers, have you ever played skinny singles. What do you think about it? Please leave your comments, please subscribe, and don't forget to have a good day.